I'm joined now by Dr. Stefan Esser of Esser Health and Southeast Orthopedic Specialists. I actually met Dr. Esser when I was being treated for a stress fracture, but found out quickly that he is so passionate about the foods we eat that I started following him on social media, and I think you're going to want to, too, after you meet him. So welcome to River City Live, Dr. Esser. Uh, it's my pleasure. Welcome to my pharmacy here. <laughs> I obviously have seen some of this on social media, and I know that you definitely practice and live what you preach, but let's talk about food, because when you were treating me, you, eat, you even took the time to talk about which foods I should be eating to heal the bone more quickly. That's right. I mean, f food is information at the cellular level, and so many people forget that. So what you're eating truly is medicine that can either improve your health or reduce it. One of the things that you mentioned online that could be considered controversial was back when we first started learning about COVID-19, you would see people with their masks and socially distancing, but filling their shopping carts out up with food that could lower your immunities. That's right. And that initial perspective I had has been validated now with all the scientific studies showing that if you're obese, diabetic, hypertensive, carrying extra weight, chronically inflamed, which of course comes from food, then your immune system. And you have higher rates of severe disease and death, not what we want for ourselves or the people we love. So especially now, we want to be filling up with the fresh fruits, vegetables, simple foods that reduce inflammation of the body and improve immunity. Well, we live close to each other. In fact, just before we went on together, we had the same helicopter going overhead. So since I have my little garden, Dr. Esser, back here, this tiny, tiny little garden. And I you, like it. Thank you. It's a start. It's a start. And you are right? surrounded by green. Can you give us a little bit of a tour so that way we know that if it's growing in your neighborhood, all of us watching no, it can grow in ours. That's right. And if I have time to be able to put this stuff in and grow it, right, when I'm in the clinic all day, every day, and writing and speaking, you guys can do it too. I would have weeded it had I known we were giving a tour. But let's start <laughs> simple. Here's some nice cucumbers. You want them to grow up on something so they don't get a lot of mildew because we're so damp around here. And I'll pop this one off. And here's a nice little one, right, kind of growing in my garden. Cute little wow. cucumber. So cucumbers are delicious, 90 plus percent water and loaded with all kinds of yumminess. If we circle around this, this is my favorite bed. We've got nice squash in here. So a nice hybrid yellow squash. And I'll go down in here and pop one off. And so you can see nice little yellow squash here. Uh, growing right in these beautiful, you know, plants right there. In addition, of course, we got a lot of stuff that can grow around here. You've got these nice little green bell peppers. We got some eggplants coming in. For the heat of the summer, those sweet potatoes are great. So I put a whole bed of sweet potatoes in here. And all I did was chop the ends off the sweet potatoes, put them in the ground, water them a little, and voila, up these come. And they just take off like crazy. And then you will enjoy sweet potatoes later this year. So, of course, kale is also great to have. So we got lots of beds of kale and all those greens because they're loaded with micronutrients and fiber, and you want to be filling up with those every day. It really is a pharmacy, you know. That's that, right. That works. Well, I have so many more questions for you, and we are going to be doing additional segments with you and talking about how different foods are beneficial in different ways and, and how you can swap this for that. But for now because you have so much information out there on social media. Can you give everybody information on where to find you? I'd be delighted. It's Esser Health on Instagram or Facebook. And my day job is with Southeast Orthopedic Specialists where I practice sports medicine and lifestyle medicine. Anywhere I can be of service, happy to see people and help them out. One of the questions I'm 